For the Brixton baby, who will be missed greatly. This last year we got closer, nothing awkward or crazy, just a cool, special kind of fool who had me in stitches. We had chats in my ride and talked about building bridges between the olders and picnics. We talked about the upliftment of the ladies in this business and they made it his business. I'm here for the ties. Amazing mural in Brixton, which is where it's from, Brixton baby. Um, it's been done by an amazing artist called Carleen D'Souza. Um, it's incredible. It's a work of heart inspired by a work of heart. Um, yeah, just here, obviously, as usual. Ty was my guy. Ty was my boy. Ty was in my same group as me, Kingdom. I've known him since we were teenagers. And um, yeah, just here, really. Just to really pay our respects and keep his name flying high for as long as we can. Till, till, we, till we pass away. You know what I mean? Um, Ty was a true son of Brixton. He really, really, really was proud of where he came from. Um, always doing a lot of activities in the community, always in the community and yeah this is just so appropriate for him to be immortalised on a building. Brixton Street Gym, Brixton Street Gym really is um, something that was done for the community by people from the community and gives people an opportunity to really stay fit, stay healthy, grow um, and yeah just doing a lot of stuff here, there's, there's trees planted in, planted in his, in his honour um, there's like a nice little tribute book thing that they're doing, I'm not sure the exact words but basically you can come and donate books for young people to come and read or anyone to come and read really, donate your books that you've read that you might think might actually help nourish some people, some other people. So yeah, everything's really done and it's done in that colour because it's all about growth, green is about growth. So that's why I'm here. Peace out.